Whenever you see movements in Kata that aren't obvious strikes, you should start thinking about the different ranges of combat. Here you can see the defender creating a wedge to open up the center line on his attacker. In the clinch, you're trying to create openings for attacks while keeping yourself safe as well. You're doing that by creating frames, splitting your opponent's guard in half, and even pummeling your arms to get to a better position, like you see here from Kata Gekisai Daini. Once you're in an advantageous position, you use your footwork to swing your body to strike or take down your opponent since they are already anchored to you. You also want to consider that if you're square against your opponent, your opponent has frames against you. So if you blade yourself like the Naihanchi Katas, you're able to slip through different cracks, find different angles, and also execute your attack more efficiently. 